Therese, what about this kid tonight? Oh, she was <laughs> awesome, as Paula said at the end of the game there. Um, she was just, I don't think they knew what to do with her tonight. She just was in top form. You were on fire, Kira. Oh, I don't know about that now. I think the ball's coming into me. Girls are feeling me it my job a little bit easier and they give good balls into me so I just had to kind of finish them in the end and lucky enough I've done some of that so yes it's girls out the field that done the hard work so I was left just to do a bit of the scoring so thank the girls out there for it. Yeah girls like Gronya who's absolutely fantastic. Yeah Gronya in fairness she done well for the time that she was on the field but um, no she had a great <laughs> now that's game. That's slow. <laughs> I'm her sister I can say that. Um, no she had a great game. I think you know um, everyone there from Monaghan's and Monaghan's behalf like um, girls dug deep you know we came out at the start of the year we didn't know if we were going to have a team and uh, the 30 girls that want to play for Monaghan proved it there today that you know what I mean we're we, we want to win an Ulster title. I know we've won nothing yet. We're in the same position as we were last year and the year before, but we really want it this year. Well, you're Cavan now in the Ulster final. That's an unusual one, but one you look forward to, a derby? Yeah, definitely. Cavan are a great side. They're up-and-coming team. Uh, they've done well in the league, and uh, we played them last year, and they give us no space, especially in the first half. So they're improving every year. They had a massive win there against Donegal. So we have nothing won yet. We have a huge test ahead of us now in two weeks' time, and we just have to knuckle down and prepare for that as best we can.